It is currently, what time is it? Sorry, as you can tell, I'm still pretty asleep. <laughs> it is currently, oh my gosh, uh, 20 to seven. We have to go, I'm dropping this one off at the airport and I am meeting the parents today. Train station. Yeah, well, sorry. So you guys get right to train with me. <laughs> yeah. This is me meeting the parents. Oh, if you're new to the channel, also make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notifications and yeah, I will try and wake up before they get here. I'm so excited. I'm nervous. Are you really? I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I'm a little... I think I'm too tired to be nervous. Yeah, well, you're not going to meet him for hours. It is strange. I'm thinking it's like, he's going to be very strange. Why? Because... Well, I have met Because they've seen you, like, nearly strip on YouTube. That's okay. They've seen you in boxers. They've seen you. <laughs> All the things. Okay. <gasps> They're almost here. It's a little tiny line. This is where we part ways. No. Under the train. It'll see you <laughs> I'm about to cry. I feel like I'm leaving you forever again. Don't worry, you're not. <laughs> okay. No, you're not. You good. come find me? Okay. Bye bye. Bye! Just, just have to keep going. Oh, I gotta buy a ticket! Shoot! I gotta do that too. Too many Christmas! Expensive stuff! Okay, now I know most of you are thinking, this girl has no idea what she's doing. You'd be right. Yeah! Made it! I am tempted to get McDonald's fries again. <laughs> I can't eat them in America. They snuck past me. They said they're in front of Optus. But got the sniff down and they still beat me. How did they beat me? Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Oh, that was <laughs> Yeah, I definitely didn't miss their bags. They definitely came out the other gate. Uh, there's my dad. Where was you? Uh, it said you were arriving at that gate. Mom hates flying. Like, hates it. So this whole 24 hours of flying thing is not good. But Dad, how did it go? Let's ask her. <laughs> how did it go, Mama? It was wonderful. Ten hours. And then what? And then I got sick. Did you really? Six and bad they were ready to put oxygen on her ticker. No, I really? They were uh, they were knocking on the door to see how she was doing. Are you kidding? <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. I don't think Sherry will be back. If I come here, it'll be by myself. <laughs> we'll be halfway in Hawaii. So we found the rental car, but, but we might have a problem. I said, Dad, you're on the wrong side. Yeah. Okay. This, this is gonna go really well. <laughs> I probably sure should have learned how to drive for this one. <laughs> how you feeling, Mama? Oh. So we're about to walk to get Mom some familiar food, and then this one passed by. So he turned around. Hey, oh, that's not very out. nice. How are you, buddy? Glad oh. we meet you finally in the three dimensions. <laughs> yes. It's so funny. I was saying before, I'm like, I feel like I know you guys, but it's different in three dimensions. It'd be like, we're going to have a word, boy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> be in trouble, like, oh, okay. So you guys are getting McDonald's out here? She is. He wants sushi. So I told See, him that's that. I'm on Steve's Mom, side. Mom hates the sushi. You don't like sushi? Weird, right? Sushi's pretty basic. But she threw up so much on the plane. They were gonna get her oxygen. The flight attendants were really worried. So here, here's some backstory, guys. I'm, I get very bad seasickness. Very bad seasickness. <laughs> you get bad air sickness, don't you? Evidently. Yeah. After ten hours. But it's in our it's in our heads. Hours. We have to. Okay. Strengthen I woke up, up and I was like, oh. That's right. Well, you can look after me when I'm throwing up on the boat. <laughs> okay. Deal. Deal. And I, you know, if I get on a plane with you guys, I'll. 
I think the two of you are pitiful. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Stacy's is bad too. She's bad on flat floor. Hey, it's true. I only get seasick after getting off the boat. Which just makes no Land sense to me sickness. at all. Land sickness. It's weird. It's not. Dad was saying he's learning the lingo. Lingo already? Yeah. So uh, a friend of mine sent me the uh, uh, information of all the odd words they use. Oh yeah. So instead of saying uh, you're going to Australia, it's uh, you're going to Australia. Australia, yeah, yeah. Australia. <laughs> you know what they call the gas station? I need to get on the lappy. Patron. Lappy? The lappy later. Yep. No, nah, no one says lappy here. No. No, nah, no, nah, that's definitely like a, a taking the Mickey out of a um, out of an American one. Instead okay. of saying service station or gas station, it's the servo. Servo. Yeah. Okay. Servo. Okay. Don't, don't say servo station. And you don't get gas, you get petrol. That makes sense. Which was a liquid. Okay. Huh. It's gasoline. Yeah. Anyway. I well, that was interesting. I don't even know what I just said. <laughs> um, that was really unexpected. I had no time to prepare. Completely just blanked out. So I don't know what I've if I've said anything good or bad. I'll have to look back at the footage. I gotta go pick them up now. We'll see how it goes. But first, I just realized this place is an absolute mess so I need to clean my car fast because there's no chance that I am going to let her parents get in this car particularly because I'm not taking the blame for this this is Stacy but I'll clean up I didn't even know there was that much stuff in there that's amazing Thanks, Dave. This car feels so much lighter now. You know, like you just have a good sweat and you feel like you've lost that half a kilo to a kilo. Currently, that's what this car feels like without that rubbish. Stacy, thank you so much. So, one thing I always want to do when I show people around Sydney, Stacey's already seen here, but I have to, at the end of my row where I live, or my parents live, there's a place called Urala Estate. So if you guys haven't been, I'll leave a little drop pin at the bottom. But this used to be an estate that was owned by a lady called Dame Edith, and it is spectacular. <laughs> And this is the actual estate. And they got like, it's all dialysis stuff and I don't know what exactly what they're doing there. Now. I think they shot um, a few scenes from, what do you call it? A few scenes from Great Gatsby around here. <laughs> so the question is, do they like me? I don't know. You, yeah. tough babe. What do you mean I didn't ask? I just assume. You're assuming? So, what do you reckon? Out like of 10? Yeah. Nine? No, like a 10. Really? Whoa! Okay. I'm, I'm feeling pretty confident with that. <laughs> a 10. And so, this is like a random bamboo structure here. Cool, huh? Yeah. <laughs> cool thing, too, is like, I mean, when I was a kid, we used to run through here a lot because it's just like, I don't know, random little stuff. Nah, we're all good. I mean, it's nothing, as an adult, you're like, meh, but when you're a kid, climbing through here was pretty fun. Uh -huh. Bamboo forest. Before we go, we have to climb this tree. I'm trying, yeah. Yeah, I feel like I could actually climb this tree. Go to your left and shimmy up that. Are you kidding? It's a lot harder. I could do it. Come on. If I jumped at it, I would. Put your foot in that little hole right there. Hey, in theory, that makes sense. So instead. Oh, we stayed too hard. Alright, time to come down. <laughs> Are you kidding? 
kidding? Just walk on it. Stand up and walk. Says the girl who won't even do it herself. Do a bear crawl. Like a bear walk. Hey! Bear walk it. Come on. I believe in you. Oh my gosh, I didn't sign up for an all-day adventure here. Neither did I. I thought this would be a quick, nice, fun little video. And now I'm scared. <laughs> are you scared, really? Oh my gosh, you are. Look, oh. if there, I'll be fine. Oh, Blake. Hey. hey. Stand up and you bear. what I signed up for. Your parents are already bored. They're like, go on. <laughs> the Blake shenanigans. <laughs> Come on, are you kidding? Uh, uh, mama! <laughs> Do you want me to get to this big tree over here so you can shimmy down it? What's that gonna do? Give you something to leverage off of. And is that level enough to leverage? Yeah, if I wiggle it down in there. Maybe. <laughs> this is hilarious! <laughs> Never did I think I'd see the day. So what are you doing? What's your plan? Are Give you me your step-by-step. Step. Giving you something. <laughs> Is that meant to be like a pole vault? Yeah. For you to hold on to. Rescue station's here. I don't know what... I... What is it that you want me to do exactly? That'd be... What the crap is that? Put it down beside of you. Put your hand on the way. There you go. Now you've got a nice leverage point. And all holding here. And we'll get you out of this tree nice and safe. What do you mean a leverage you're point? You're going to turn around backwards. And you're going to put your right foot in this hole. And your hands are going to grab here. And then I'm gonna help you get down because you're scared, you, little bit. That, that's where that's where the bad part is. What? Like, you you realize me holding onto that doesn't do anything. Okay, then here, put this on your other side, and then you've got a safety barrier, so you won't fall out too far. And I'll hold it here, and I got myself leveraged here, and we'll make sure that this little bear is nice and protected, and we get him out of the tree safely. I just don't feel confident with I don't know Are what you you're trying to do. Okay, give me the camera. Where does my feet go? You're gonna turn around. No, I, I've and gotten you're that part. Put your right foot or your left foot into this hole. Yeah. And then I'm basically gonna grab your hips and guide your other foot down to here. And you're gonna use this to hold on to. Because when you got weight on this. Um, oh, yeah, that seems real safe. It, just, it had to roll. Wow. To, no, it had to roll to the right. Oh, spot, cool. And, like, this looks really safe, too. Stop. Yeah. Gonna, that's why I'm holding it. Okay. I can reach there. Come on. Just come down, little bear. I just don't, like, I don't think you understand what the issue is. The issue is that falling that way. Yeah, that's why I've got you a barrier here. That you barely can, like, this. This is your fence. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me just give you all my body weight and see if you hold it. Hey, what are you doing? It wouldn't be all your body weight, That's dork. my body weight if I start falling. You're not going to start falling. You've got leverage over here, too. Why are you too. falling my kneecap? No one cares about my shins. I care about my skull. Come on, turn around. All right, hold. You literally just have to make it into my arms. Because you know how strong you are. No. Why are you filming my shin again? <laughs> I'm looking. I'm literally like a 12 year old boy stuck in a tree right you now. You are, and it's so funny. You're like a cat on a power line. Yes. You're frozen. Do I need to call emergency services? Maybe. And get a ladder? <laughs> literally just bring your car down, like just drive the car, and I'll jump on the roof. Your car? It's just gear one, right? <laughs> my dad knows how to drive a standard. Do you really need that? No cars on the grass, babe. Come on. You're hilarious. This is making my whole life right now. Because you're not up here. It's very different once you get it's up here. Not. Oh, it's not. Oh, really? Are you up here? Okay, come on. Look, I did the only thing that I knew how to do, okay? Which is not safe at all. Do you want me to wedge that in the ground down there so you've got something like that? Actually, that could work. Okay. I was trying to get out of this tree. But, baby. This is where I would want it. I overpower you with one arm. 
Yeah, and I'm know. worried that you like, and you want to hold on to my whole weight with one arm. I'm just trying to give. I'm you just like, look, I'm just saying, I'm not very confident look, in your strength right now. I love you to bits. Just, I'm not confident in your strength right all now. All it was was a place to hold your hands to give you mental security, but no stability. <laughs> you got a grasshopper on your shoulder. No way. Look. Yeah, you can. No, I can't. He's on your shoulder. No, I'm scared. So you're telling <laughs> So you're telling me I'm a wimp coming up jumping out of a tree and there's a gra cute little green grasshopper on your shoulder. Okay, it's descriptatory. Give me some more details. Ooh. It's a oh. green grasshopper. Maybe this is a sign. Of what? In my past life I was a butterfly and I went in a but a Oh he's dancing on you and hitting you. But a dancing. but a grasshopper was in love with me. And he said, I'll keep being reborn until we can be humans and be together. What? It's the truth. That was my Vipassana experience for anybody who wants real in-depth crazy stuff. Yeah, don't do drugs, kids. Stop. It's real. <laughs> I can't see it. It was really... It's on your shoulder. Just go and like, tap him. <laughs> I don't want to hurt him. Tap him. How big is he? No, you lie. <laughs> Flip the screen up. Flip the screen up, let me see. Flip the screen up, are wow. you lying? So you've, been, so you've been giving me crap for not wanting to jump four or five meters oh. into the, off like a tree. You have literally a cute little grass over your shoulder and you're freaking out. How did he get there? Rich! <laughs> he's in your hair now. He's, he's in your hair. What's he's up? hanging off your, oh, he's gone now. He was hanging off one of your things like Tarzan. He's on your neck now. No, really? So he's crawling up <laughs> He's crawling up. <laughs> he's, uh, he's literally about to go in your ear. You can't feel him? Are you lying right now? No. He's on your neck. <laughs> Are you... He's on your neck now. He's crawling on your neck. No, don't go away. The camera's here. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Come up so I can see it. Come up so I can see. I can't see. I'm, I'm, I'm get half him, a tree. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Are you crying? <laughs> Are you sure he's gone? This is like the best revenge ever. <laughs> Flip this he's screen. gone now. You sure? Um, well, I can't see him. He could be somewhere in your hair. Let me see. Hurry up. Flip the screen up. Let me see. <laughs> he's gone. You sure he's not back here? No, I'm not sure. Oh, he's tiny. I must have stepped on him. That is not. That right there goes to show you, ladies and gentlemen, what your mind will do. Yeah, and when you're when you're this far up a tree, and you're getting from your girlfriend that you won't jump down five meters onto hard floor, and then she gets a grass with this big on her shoulder and starts crying. That is karma. Like that is karma. I feel good now. I'm just gonna chill up here. Like I'm just gonna rest up here because I, you know, revenge is best served by nature. Now your problems are over and my problems are beginning. I thought he was really big. I can feel him crawling. You didn't want to kill him. Alright, I'm going to try and get down. Here's your little lever. Oh, there's those little knobbly things there that are fucking going to screw me over. Stop filling me my crutch. No one wants to see that. <laughs> Just walk. Or just come down here, hurry up. Look, there's another little place here that your foot can go and you can grab this here. I like how confident you say it when you find it. I can't, you're stuck. There you go. Now, put this foot here in this divot. I'll guide it. If it's more that there's nothing for me to hold on to, move that stick down here. Where are your parents? They're just giving up. Good. Here's your rock climbing skills for me. See, it's more as well. Everything. Get my shoes off. <laughs> Is this your first time taking shoes? <laughs> They're so tight. Yeah, I don't want them falling off. Oh, there we go. Freedom at last. Did you get your other one? It's worse. 
Nah, it's so much better. Did you get your other one off? It's like slippery now. Nah. Okay. I like how you tell me, like you also. There you go. You got it. Hold my foot, hold my foot. My foot, that's my foot. I like how you feel my shin, baby. I'm trying to film your face, but it's really hard. Okay, here, you're gonna hit my foot and it's okay. Then go for my flips a little. <laughs> hold me left, hold my left, hold my left. Hold my left, that's my back. Your what? My bum cheek, really? <laughs> my left fucking back, babe. Both left on my back. What? That's my ass. <laughs> your you back? Know, oh my fucking God, hold, hold the left of me. <laughs> fucking hell. Hold my left. Sure, I'll grab your right ass cheek. You should say, you just, you should say like, you, my do... left side body. You made that. When you watch this video back, you're going to be like, I was such a... Hold, hold my left. Hold my left. Sure. <laughs> you should have said my left side. I, I said that. You left know, I... side body. Side body is not a body part. It's side body. You <laughs> literally... You just made that into the most dramatic thing I've ever witnessed in my life. Like you just took Drama King to a whole... <laughs> like do you see how tall you are? Like you can barely pretty much stand up. It's like when the kid's like, oh, I'm drowning, I'm drowning, I'm drowning. Put your feet down. Uh. <laughs> Come and do this. I'm not going to do it, I'm not going to do it. You're like, eh, I can do it. I can I've easily climbed, do it, but you won't climb up and do it. I've climbed Prove many trees. No. Not today. Because it's maybe, it might look it, like that was the thing. When I climbed up, I'm like, yeah, that's cool to get back down. I get up and I'm like, nah, not so cool. Because you were so worked out by that point. Because you <clears throat> couldn't jump off, you couldn't waddle down. But like you, your brain starts taking over at that point. It's like, no, it wasn't that. <laughs> babe, my brain wasn't taking over. It was like, if I jumped down the left side and landed, there were problems. There was those sticks there that were like yeah. being chopped off branches. The other side was too big. Yeah. Like I had to, I would have had to commit to like a five meter drop. Onto ground. You won't even jump into the water off three meters. Yeah. You're telling me you would do it. I told you it's not jumping in the water. It's the sharks that I think are gonna be there. So my rational fear of breaking my ankle off a five meter drop is more makes more like less sense than sharks in a place in the middle of Blue Mountains. I hate to tell you, sharks don't even go there. I didn't think they went there. I think people put them there. Who would put a shark? Crazy person. There's no way you would do it. Just made my whole day. I like seeing you scared. That was funny. I mean, don't do it all the time because then I won't feel very confident that you could save me. I wasn't confident with you as your help. Like, here, use this flimsy stick. My help stick. was so great. No, it wasn't, babe. It I was not. I had so many options with that. But none that would be good. Yeah. Oh, here, At least... here babe. I'll hold on to this stick that isn't supported, and then At I will hold three... your body weight. I didn't want your whole body weight. I figured if you toppled that weight just a tiny bit. You like, would not be. What happens if I fell? There's no was, way you're gonna catch me. You didn't understand the concept in my head. Look at you, hey? My body weight. Hey! See? Can't do it! No, but you were just gonna use that as a hand grip. But the baby, that was the problem. The problem was I couldn't get down and just use something to hold it. Like, I needed something to hold me. That's why that holding that. Like, like, look at my arm. Aww. I had to leverage my forearm to hold, and it was just ripping my arm off. I can get down easily, she said. I can get down easy. That's one that I probably will. I probably will have you bring me back here and try it. Oh. So we found her parents. They're at my car. I illegally parked. So I've obviously been gone a lot longer than I thought I was going to be. I thought I was going to be gone for like. The tree? Five minutes. It's now turned into like 35 minutes because I was stuck in a tree. For 20. For <laughs> 20. And it looks like they're talking to a um, oh, a council person. Yeah. I I really hope they're playing like the, the tourist thing. Like, oh, we didn't know. I'm sorry, blah, blah, blah. But I'm pretty sure I'm about to get told off. Because there's, oh, there's a guy parked there too. 